So since the beta for Back for Blood dropped, I've seen the game receive some negative reviews. I mean loads of them. I myself have liked what I've experienced so far, but in regards to some people and what people are saying, they ain't really wrong. Is Back for Blood good enough to be labelled Left 4 Dead 3? Well today guys we get into it. How's it going people? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. So the Back for Blood beta has been out a few days now. The open beta starts on the 12th of August. I myself have played the beta, I haven't butchered it as I do want to wait for the full game before I give my honest opinion on it, as judging the full game of the beta in my opinion just isn't fair. But in saying that, we learn a lot from the beta in terms of the way in which this game performs and feels. Now like I said, I have enjoyed what I have played so far and will be picking it up, but this isn't the case for many folks out there, and for me it seems as though it is the majority of people who have played it too. I'm not saying more people hate the game than they do like it, it's just from what I've seen, they are definitely louder. So the game itself, is it what we expected it to be? Us fighting through levels of zombies, basically a bloodbath of zombie killing action. It ticks the boxes there. It also feels like how I remember Left 4 Dead feeling. Something I have never really liked with other zombie games, like COD. This to me just feels better in a sense of it being more arcadey how I remember Left 4 Dead. The game has a, like a card system which right now I haven't dug too deep into as within the beta I don't feel it impacts like it will within the harder stages of the full game so this I won't judge right now. But other than that that's what Back for Blood is. Now the reason people are being negative towards the game is because what since 2009-2010 when Left 4 Dead 2 was released we have had many, many, many amazing zombie games. Some in my opinion even better than Left 4 Dead by a country mile. Although they are a different kind of zombie games, they have taken that zombie killing madness to whole other levels. Games like Dead Island, Dying Light just to name a few. These are just incredible games, which take more or less most things Left 4 Dead offers and just evolves them up to newer and better levels. So in a way we've kind of been spoiled rotten with zombie games. Then going back to Back for Blood, yes it feels like Left 4 Dead which isn't a bad thing, but it is in reality levels below what we have experienced with zombie games since Left 4 Dead 2. And that's how people are judging it, even if they don't think they are. I personally when I remember Left 4 Dead, I remember struggling to a point of almost giving up, but because it was so addictive trying to just complete the game, just being crazy hectic playing with my brother. It was fun, crazy madness. It was also within a time where games as such were rare. Nowadays, these kind of games are 10 to a dozen, which offer that same form of excitement when playing with friends. So it isn't something we are missing. And although people think they miss Left 4 Dead, when they eventually play Back 4 Blood, which will no doubt be a better built game than Left 4 Dead ever was, it just won't feel it. Now I will add I'm going off the beta here only and this is just my opinion on what I'm seeing. I personally like Battle for Blood and I will be playing the full game for sure. But will it fit the shoes of a Left 4 Dead experience like back in the day? I'm not sure it will. And on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out and hopefully guys, I will see you on that next one.